Hey there, RGV. Today on Valley Por Vida, we're dissecting the National Month calendar, plus we're seeing what's up in the world of movies, in case you missed it. The show starts right now. Alright, thanks again so much for joining us on Valley Por Vida. I'm your host, Danielle Bonda. Now, it might be the second to last day of November, but it's always something uh, fun to do, something fun to celebrate, to honor, you know, when you're looking at the National Day calendar. So, let's go ahead and see what we can still take part in for November. So according to the nationaldaycalendar.com, it seems the month of November marks Gluten-Free Diet Awareness Month. So this is our chance to learn about the causes of celiac disease and see if we can maybe adjust uh, our nutrition and food habits to get better uh, if applicable. So even if our, uh, we ourselves are not you know, really quite affected by this medical condition, I mean, it's still a good idea uh, to know that it affects many people across the globe. And it's always nice to be courteous when someone comes uh, to the house, you know, strangers, friends, family, coworkers, and you're prepared, especially if you know that they happen to follow a gluten-free diet. After all, for those affected, it's not just a diet. It's a literal lifestyle that can help to decrease their body's inflammation and can honestly have life-saving results. So it's just nice for us to keep that in mind whenever we can so that we're aware. The uh, site also says that it's a historic bridge awareness month and it's kind of cool because every time I see a bridge on my travels or you know here in the valley I always think how in the world do they build those? I mean the engineering is amazing and it's just astonishing to see the architecture that goes into some of these structures. I mean some bridges are iconic you know for their roles um, in the background environments of films and TV shows and others are just well known for their role in United States history or world history in general and others are just just adored for their beauty or their uniqueness. And this is the month that we can take a little extra time to appreciate their existence. Get this, the month of November also marks National Career Development Month, which is great because it's always a time for us to really hone in on our own skill set and see how it might be advantageous for us in our own workforce. The site recommends that we attend job fairs and see, you know, if we can help others shape their future, their job paths, perhaps in a form of a mentorship. Um, you know, whatever field that you happen to be in, this month can be a great chance for us to discover our professional purpose and really try to develop our own employment futures. The site also outlines that this is a great chance to try and develop not only your skills and your talents, but to grow in leadership and overall confidence. So we can always try to improve our mindsets, of course, by reading entrepreneurship or business books. Or we can try and find someone who's in the field that we're seeking to get in ourselves, see if maybe we can observe their own workflow and just learn from them. And we can try to build our character, too, our ability to grasp things quickly, bounce back, you know, when we make mistakes, and of course, work with others in a collaborative sense. Now, lastly, the month of November marks National Gratitude Month, and that makes sense since it's the time of year that we love to celebrate Thanksgiving. But the important thing here is to remember not to be grateful for only one day a year. Rather, we learn to see the joys in all that we do and really just take time to show appreciation for the little things in life. The site says it's more than just saying thank you, but it's really about us shifting our focus from negative perspectives to positive and productive ones, which ultimately, of course, makes for a more powerful and meaningful life. All right, well, with that in mind, we hope that some of these tips help make the very best of what's left this month of November. But don't go anywhere because we're going to be back and we're going to uh, have a lot more in just a bit.